awakening means to us right now is that what we've always known has suddenly possessed us. What we always knew was true. We've talked about the love of God. We've even felt it some. But now it seems like that which we felt was such a small measure compared to what he's pouring out now. Everything that was simple and true has been come magnanimous in our hearts. You know, the love of God, the righteousness of God, the power of God, the goodness of God, the mercy of God, the severity of God. It's like, um, the best way I can say it is, suddenly we've been possessed by that which we've always known to be true. And so personally, I've been awakened. Personally, my life's been changed. Personally, the, I've watched the students change. Third and fourth year students, you know, weeping like they just got saved. And so every night at the awakening, something happens where I think somebody in our midst feels like, I just got saved, but they've been a believer for 30 years. Um, I feel that in areas of my life. And so everything is becoming magnanimous in here. That which we've known has suddenly exploded. And it's like full possession. I can't even describe it. It's like what has always been faithful. We've been faithful and diligent with the truth. Suddenly now we've been possessed by it. And I, I never want to go back. <laughs> I, I want to be possessed by God. And so I've been awakened to Him. And suddenly I've been awakened to Him within me. And I think we've been awakened to Him within us. You know, we've fallen in love with each other now. I mean, our, our body has been together for 10 years, but I look over and, you know, at Wes Hall and Shelly Hundley and Julie Meyer and all the different leaders, Mike Pickle, and I go, I really love those people now. I mean, I really like them. And suddenly everything's changed. The atmosphere is not competition. The atmosphere is not who knows the most, who's the best. The atmosphere is, oh my, he's here. He's the honored guest, and I really like who he's invited to the party. <laughs> and so that's awakening for me.